Come and sit down, Alison and Peter. This is a very exciting moment for me. I'm just blown away to be in the same room as the two people who came up with my most favourite show of all time, Number One. Now, let me introduce you to my team, disabled ethnic teenage pufter and woman. Don't talk to them, they're just here to tick boxes. And you know what? None of them went to Oxford. I love diversity. I went to Oxford. Sorry, what I meant to say is I didn't go to Oxford. I did! So it's fantastic to have you both here, Alison and Peter. Amanda, get these guys some drugs. Amanda went to Oxford too, by which I mean Amanda didn't go to Oxford either. So, one question. How the hell did you ever come up with Number Wang? Well, Peter, um... I don't want to know. Please don't tell me. Great story, I'm not interested. Now, I'm not going to pretend to understand the creative process, because I don't understand the creative process, and because I don't know how to pretend. But we're all agreed that Number Wang has been off our screens for far too long. So I want you to have a look at this. This is a picture of a hot woman who let me touch her boob once. Yes! <laughs> Don't look at the box tickers. You see that ethnic one? He'll be the head of news one day if we let him, which we won't. Now, here's a list of the kind of people that watch the sort of programmes that we make. Oh, your demographics. I don't like to use that word, Alison, because I don't know what it means. <laughs> now, the sort of person who watched Number Wang was old, weird, had a hat, smelled and were Belgian, which is brilliant in a way that is awful. But nowadays, we're about appealing to a different kind of audience, an audience that is young, diverse, youngly diverse, diversely young, ethnically youthful and homosexually young. And we think that that audience wants us to bring back Number Wang in a way that retains all of its original features, but it's basically like skins. <laughs> well, we've got this proposal. Peter, I don't want to read your proposal. I'm not going to read it. I can't read it. I don't know how to read. I used to know how to read, but when I took this job, they burnt out a large part of my brain with a hot wire. So answer me this question in two words. Can you make the programme yes, yes or no, no? No, no, we don't want to make it. That's fantastic! Here's some money. I want it by the beginning of next month. And remember, young, young, youthy, young, teenagers, young people, youth some teenager youngness, and above all, number one. Do it. Make it now. Make me the new number one. Go and make the new number one. Bring me the new number one. Do it. Number one, number one, number one, number one. Amanda, can you get me some new pants in here, please? I think I may have pissed myself and come at the same time. I think there might be a documentary in it.